<laughs> Alrighty, and I am back to bring you guys another video. But before we get started, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for the fucking support, guys. It has been so amazing. Oh my god, I'm so overwhelmed with excitement. And I hope I can keep doing this with you guys. I've really been enjoying it so freaking much. Oh my god, you guys don't know how freaking amazing it's been. Thanks to you guys. And thank you to those who have been awaiting this video to come out. I'm sorry, I, I, I got busy, I got sick, you know, work and all that, but... All of that sounds like excuses to you guys, so I'm just gonna shut the hell up. <laughs> and as always, timestamps are gonna be in the description below or in the video. And let me know what you guys enjoyed about the video in the comment section below, alright? I, I wanna know what you guys enjoyed the most. I appreciate all the comments, I, I really do. It's amazing when I see a comment. And now, back to the video. I now present you the strongest mage build in Elden Ring with only 37 intelligence both in-game and in real life. <laughs> Whatever, man. Tarnished warrior. Put these foolish... No, no, no! No! Put these foolish ambitions to rest. Maybe I made the wrong build. Maybe, maybe, maybe... maybe. Psych! Oh, you thought that was it, huh? Kabooch! Woo! Oh my god! Watch, watch, watch. <laughs> He's gone! <laughs> Astrologer, man. Astrologer. Astrologer. Alright. What should we call him? What should we call him? The Glint Rock. The, <laughs> the Glint Rock Johnson. And already I destroyed the first boss. Oh my god. Already we are broken. Oh, just kidding. Never mind. <laughs> Ooh, Limgrave. Let's meet the locals. Oh. What up? Oh, yes. Tarnished, are we? Unfortunately for you, however, you are maidenless. I gotta kill it, I gotta kill it. I have to kill it, you guys. What? Only 113? Early on, your spells and sorceries deal a decent amount of damage. Right? Oh my god. Oh my god. Here we go again. Mine's better, boy. Try it. <laughs> Try it again. Foul 
tarnished. Let's be honest. Your early on damage is bad. It's so bad. Oh my god. I, why? Why? Why is it? Why is it this bad? Why is it so fucking? Put these foolish ambitions to rest. That's okay. We can do better. In Kaelid, there's a staff called the Meteorite Staff, which is the best staff you can get early on in the game. Um, can I? I'm. I'm not. What? And here are the stat requirements. I needed some runes to level up, so I then farmed ball sacks. I mean balls for some runes. Oh yeah. No, we're good. We're good. Yeah. There we go. One sixty one. That damage is a little bit better, but we can do better. Put these foolish ambitions to rest. Let me buy that. Wait, can I just can I just Yeah, fuck it. Just... Boom! Oh, no way! <laughs> Wait, this guy is stuck? <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, he was about to spin. Dude, he was about to spin and kill me. God, do not jump off again. Jesus, man. <gasps> What's this? Here we go now. Now that's what I'd like to see, baby. Woo! Well, thou art of passing skill. <laughs> Come on, rematch, boy. What? What? God damn. <laughs> now, I could have killed Godric like how I did Margit, but I still feel like we could do better. There's still something missing. Hmm. Oh, right. That. That thing. Some of you guys might already know what I'm talking about. <sighs> Come on, I'm so close! No, no, no! No! Blast this fool! Blast this fool! Yeah, 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 blast this fool! 
Nope, keep blasting them. Keep blasting them. You're dead. <laughs> yes. Oh yeah, it's time. It's time to go mental. Okay, hold on. Let's see, do we have enough? Do we have enough? Um, do we have enough decks? Yes! The pike's gotta be right, this one, right? Oh yeah, it is, it is. Oh! Uh, what? You know, I completely forgot that there was an upgrade system in the game. <laughs> Fuck. This weapon requires somber smithing stones to upgrade it, and there's a very limited amount of somber stones out in the open world. Plus, the bell bearings are endgame. So, let me show you guys how to get them early on. Yes. 1 through 4 can be bought from this guy. So. Bump, bump, bump. Bum, 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 bum. Back here. Boom! There's number six. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Whoa. Oh my god, they patched it. They patched the skip. That's okay. I'll show you a different skip. <gasps> oh my god! Um, yeah. You want to teleport to the first step, and then as it's loading in, you want to quit out. Like you want to Alt F4 right now. Boom. At the end of the- yeah. It should- yeah. See? <laughs> it still works. Oh my god, it still works. Oh my god. Whatever. Oh! Well, what about the ancient dragon somber smithing stone, Rio? Hmm, you know what? I don't think we'll need it. You'll see why. And we did it again, baby! Look at that damage! That damage is absolutely mental! <laughs> Look at me! Yeah, I don't... Oh, you've got a shield? Block this. Parry this, you donut. Oh my god! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Actually, do I even need it? I don't think so.
Oh, you know what? Yeah, I won't kill them. Renala was by far the easiest boss that I fought. Oh my god. If I wasn't doing a mage build. <laughs> Shit. Uh. Let's see here. Renala, queen of the full moon. Let's look at her absorptions. 80% magic. 80% magic damage. What the fuck? Okay. What, like, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I have no idea what I'm gonna do. That's the end of this video, I guess. Or is it? You know, there is something I can do. Remember that pike that I grabbed from Stormvale Castle? Well, that's gonna be important. Yeah, Gaetan Bridge. Uh, pastime. Now? Then. One more! One more! Look at my health! Oh yeah! <laughs> this Ashavar about a bust. Usable on polar arms capable of thrusting and twin blades. Polar arms. And what did we get earlier in Stormvale Castle? Right, the pike. And you can put an Ashavar on it. Oh my god. Alright. We just gotta get more runes to level up. There we go. If you guys play Elden Ring, you know that Frostbite procs are health percentage based damage. If you want to, you can check my other video about Frostbite and how it can become one of the strongest builds in the game. We also need smithing stones to upgrade normal weapons without unique skills. Oh, you're done. You're done for. You are done for! My turn, ready? Boom! <laughs> ah. Cool. Go, oh, cool, cool. Oh, yes, baby. Whoa! Oh, you thought you could stop me? You thought you could absorb my damage? Absorb these nuts, Renala. Absorb these nuts. Oh 
my god! Sweetings. I see. A choice well made. Thou art a rare sword. Indeed. Not many would have accepted the offer. You know, I'm getting bored with using Moonveil. So let's switch it up a bit. And I can already see the comments section. <laughs> Moon Moonveil. Moonveil build only Moon Moonveil. I know. But before I do that, I went ahead and gathered a couple more things to increase my damage. And if I do sound sick a little bit throughout the entire video from now on, that's because I am. And that's probably why this won't be out in a time that I expected it to be. So, sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, boy! Come on! There we go. <laughs> hey! Let's go! Let's go! Actually, yeah. I don't need the other ones. <laughs> ah, come on, Radon. Boom. Oh, a dogged fellow, aren't we? Hell yeah, I am. Please. Oh. Okay. Up here. Then you jump down here. Boom. Get this. Oh, <gasps> mushroom crown. There you go. Come on. Oh, thank God. What? Come on. One more. Put it on, put it on. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yes. Yes!
Give me that dull ussy if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> my saying, my saying. So it was thee who would become my lord. No dull ussy, no no witch ussy. Oh, I get that though. Oh, I get that though. Oh, it killed. <laughs> Got it. But you mustn't use it just yet. Don't care. When I tell you the amount of times that I got bosses to 1 HP, oh my god, I was gonna lose my shit. No! Do the leap? Baby, come on. And now that we've gathered most of the items, watch this. Watch this damage, you motherfuckers. Please, please don't click out of the video. I meant that in a most loving way. Hopefully it doesn't. Hopefully it doesn't detect us. Oh, we're good. <laughs> we're good. All right. Damage. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, it's gone. Thank god rats can't freaking jump up the ladder. I mean, not jump up, but like climb. Thank god rats can't climb the ladder. Boom! We also get a new and better rune farm after finishing Vare's questline. Okay. Cool. Wait, did I just say rune farm? Come on! Yes! Boom! Oh my god, look at that damage. You're dead. <laughs> He's not dead yet? Oh, he is, he is, he is. What race? Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Put these foolish ambitions to rest. Wait, wait, please. We can do business if you like. Cheers for that. Hit him, hit him, hit him. There we go. We only have a small time frame between our stuff. Okay. Okay, okay. I like it. He's close by. Woo! And we don't miss. We never miss. We hit all those holes. We hit all those holes. <laughs> what am I saying? I now realize as I'm recording this that I'm way dumber than I think I am. Oh my god. <laughs> the, da <laughs> the, the damage. How am I still sick? It's been a week since then. Bro, am I doing a T pose? Oh no. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh my god, we can't kill him. You know what that means? We have to find something else to kill him with. That's a total lie. I just wanted to use the Carrion Granger Ash of War. Did 
this. Come on. Come on! Come on! <laughs> yeah! You like that? I do. <laughs> oh my god! Come on! <laughs> yes. You know, I didn't expect myself to one-shot these two bosses. Usually, I would go in a spiral of rage, you know, because of their... <laughs> come on, it's it's the gods can do it. Like, come on. Like, 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 like. Can, do I need to explain myself more? Please? Come on. Come on. <laughs> okay. You're dead. You're next. Next one. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. Now in the very first patch of Elden Ring, they did nerf the damage of Sword of Night and Flame. Which is sad. Oh! Please, Crystallion. Drink this. Then this. Right? <laughs> okay. Okay. But as you can see, the results in the screen tell otherwise. The results on the screen tell otherwise. Like, look at that damouge! Look at that damouge! The next boss I wanted to kill was Riker. The problem is, Riker's boss fight is designed with the intention of players using the Serpent Hunter spear. Because you can try your best to get close to him, but there is bullshit around him, so you can't do that. But not to worry, me and my massive of a brain found a solution for this. Oh man, this is the cheesiest shit I've ever done. Come on. Got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. Alright, now that we've got something to break his stance, it's time to deal damage. Of course, I already tried the Moonlight Greatsword. Once you empower your weapon, he would already be up from his stance break. So, that doesn't work. So, I tried something else.
Okay, here we go. <laughs> Come to me. Come on. Come to me. <laughs> oh my god, I'm killing Millicent again. It's not my fault. She is one of the few unique talismans in the game. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> we got that. We got it. We got it. We got it. Please. One more. One more. One more. Cool. Cool. God, dude. Oh my. Twelve thousand. Oh, please. Let's go! Okay. Let's do this. Oh shit. Oh shit. In the second phase, his pool of lava got bigger for whatever reason, so I couldn't do what I did on the first phase, so I just moved on. I'm not gonna waste my time here. I did get through his first phase, so... Hey, there you go. I did my best. Loretta was a straightforward boss and was fairly simple to take care of. Oh my god! One more! Look at my health! Woo! My. And then I fought Melania. I am Melania, Blade of Mikola. Why am I doing this, man? I am Melania. Blade <clears throat> Correction. I skipped Melania. <clears throat> Correction again. I don't know who Melania is. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Roast me in the comment section, guys. Malekith was fairly difficult, but I still managed to kill him. This was also the first boss that gave me a hard time on my first playthrough.
No. In my bones. A tarnished cannot become a lord. Not even you. A man cannot kill a god. Watch me. But the last three bosses. Oh, let me tell you. You know what? Actually, just watch. Just watch. That's right, get up, get up. Okay. Oh, I need to run. He's gonna fucking breath. I'm here. God. Oof. That was pretty tough. <laughs> yes. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Look at all those buffs, man. Crazy. Ankles and your face. Got him. Come on. Come on. Come on. Woo! Thy strength befits a crown. When I tell you that this fight took over two hours to record, believe me, just believe me. So, other methods were necessary. And good thing I saved the best one for last. Okay, what the hell? Come on! 
my god, it's fucking done. KFC? KFC? Let me see. I don't have any. <laughs> Only 37? Fuck it. And here are some bonus clips for sorceries and skills that I didn't showcase or just forgot to use them. You know what? You deserve this. <laughs> you deserve that. Oh my god! <laughs> Try it. <laughs> well, thou art of passing skill. Warrior blood must truly run in thy veins. Tarnished. <laughs> Will that even reach him? I, it, it does. <laughs> you alright? <laughs> okay, well it's it's dead, so it's dead. <laughs> oh my god. Hello? I have no idea. Oh my god, he's dead. <laughs> Let me tell you something right now. Let me tell you something right now. You're dead. Understand me? <laughs> Boy! <laughs> you all right, Godric? Yeah, you all right? Here, let's do it one more time. I am the Lord of all. <laughs> uh oh. And if you do want to take away something from this build, I'd say the Death Spoker and the sort of Night and Flame combination is the strongest. It really is, it destroys any boss if you want to do a magic build. Okay. Watch this. Watch, watch, watch. <laughs> He's gone! <laughs> Oh my god! And that, my wonderful viewers, is how I beat Elden Ring with the strongest mage build with only 37 intelligence. No Comet Azor, obviously. And now, as I'm looking back at the recordings, I probably should have leveled up my vigor like some of you guys suggested, and that probably would have made the last part a thousand times easier. But, I deliver, and here it is. And if there's anything you guys want me to change about the video format, like taking out the gathering stuff or farming, you know, just let me know, okay? If it makes the video more interesting to some of you guys, or like a lot of you guys, then yeah, I will do that. And I will be linking links in the description below for the items and things that I used in the video. And again, I just want to thank you guys so fucking much for the subscribes and the comments, especially to those who commented and subscribed. Oh my god, the support is so amazing. I feel so fucking happy. Thank you. Thank you guys so much again. Oh my god. You know, feedback just gives me so much to work on.
and thank you thank you for you know taking the time to do that i appreciate that so fucking much guys and i hope i can keep doing this with you guys i really do i, I i'm enjoying this so much also how do you guys feel about me recording and uploading different games let me know in the comment section okay these viewers man you guys you guys must have some big dick energy or like fucking grippy gorilla grippy coochie shit <laughs> what am i saying what am i saying oh i'm out i'm out whatever i'm out well as always have fun be safe and don't stress too much and i'm outies Woo! Blast this fool. Blast this fool. Oh.